all that exists throughout all time and beyond is one infinite divine consciousness, free and blissful, which projects within the field of its awareness a vast multiplicity of apparently differentiated subjects and objects. Each object an actualization of a timeless potential potentiality inherent in the light of consciousness and each subject you and I the same plus a contracted locus of self-awareness this creation a divine play is the result of the natural impulse within consciousness to express the total totality of its self-knowledge in action. An impulse arising from love. The unburdened light of consciousness contracts into infinite embodied loci of awareness out of its own free will. When those finite subjects then identify with the limited and circumscribed cog cognitions and circumstances that make up the phase of their existence, instead of identifying with the tran transcendent transindividual tran trans individual overreaching pulsation of pure awareness that is their true nature they experience what they call suffering to rectify this some feel an inner urge to take up the path a spiritual wisdom and yogi practice. The purpose of which is to undermine their misidentification and directly reveal within the immediacy of awareness the fact that the divine powers of consciousness, bliss, willing, knowing and acting comprise the totality of individual experience as well, thereby triggering a recognition that one's real identity is that of the highest divinity, the whole in every part. This experiential insight is repeated and reinforced throughout various means until it becomes the non-conceptual ground of every moment of experience and one's contracted sense of self and separation from the whole is finally annihilated in the incandescent radiance of the complete expansion into perfect wholeness, when one's perception fully encompasses the reality of a universe dancing ecstatically in the animation of its completely perfect divinity.